Hey Lions, welcome back to one of the final weeks of the fall semester. Make sure to study hard and end the semester on the upper hand. Let's take a look at what's happening around the University of Arkansas, Fort Smith. The library is extending their hours to make sure students have the resources available to knock finals right out of the park. Now through December 13th, the library is open late. The library is also offering late night stress busters December 8th through the 12th in room 122. Free coffee, snacks, and stress reliever starts every night at 6 p.m. UAFS Dining Services will close for winter break on Friday, December 13th. The Campus Center Food Court and Starbucks will close at 2.30 p.m. and the Lion's Den Dining Hall will close at 6 p.m. If you need to order catering over the winter break, you can contact Justin Butcher. Payment plans for the spring 2020 term are now available through the Online Business Center. In order to stay enrolled in the spring term, students must have their balance either paid in full, have it covered by financial aid, or have a payment plan in place by the payment deadline. A plan may be set up for the spring 2020 term to avoid being removed from any of your classes if you do not have enough financial aid to cover your charges, or if you can't pay your balance in full by the deadline date of 5 p.m. January 3, 2020. The Baha'i Club has a list of workshops and events to look forward to in the upcoming semester. You can check the full list of their events on Numalink or in the weekly announcements. Monday, December 16th in Vines 227 is Reflections on the Life of the Spirit. This is a full-day workshop with a purpose to raise capacity to serve the campus and the community. The workshop covers three main themes, life and death, the power of prayer, and the nature of the human spirit. Make sure to RSVP with the Baha'i Club advisor, Dr. Mary Sabani. If you want to cheer on your fellow Lions to get their degrees, graduation is quickly approaching. 10 a.m. Saturday, December 14th in the Stubblefield Center is the Fall 2019 Commencement. I'm graduating, so come watch me strut my stuff and get my diploma from the one and only Dr. Teresa Riley. And we've had a full week of UAFS athletics, so let's check in with Rachel for our sports recap. Thanks, Logan. Not only was this week a full one, but it was a tough one for UAFS athletics. Saturday, women's basketball fell to Drury on the road. Two players stood out this week. Freshman guard Ashanti Eden had 17 points and two rebounds, along with senior Tamara Gully with 17 points and 11 rebounds. The men's basketball team had two games this week and unfortunately lost against Harding and Hendricks University. Brian Halems led the offense and defense against Harding with 20 points and nine rebounds. Against Hendricks, Brian Halems and Matthew Wilson had 26 and 22 points apiece. However, they are still feeling optimistic about going into second semester. As for volleyball, they did win the first round against Texas A&M Commerce. Amanda Van White did a great job of spreading the offense with Anna Dimmer and Nori Ceballos Plaza, each having 12 kills. The Lady Lions lost to the first seed, Regis, in three sets. Rachel Williams led the way with 10 kills in their final game of the season. Even though the Lions did not come out with any wins, they are still hopeful and looking forward to the next semester. Enjoy your break and happy holidays. Thanks, Rachel. This has been my last weekly announcements here at the University of Arkansas, Fort Smith. I just want to extend my deepest gratitude to the marketing department, the media communication department, and the theater department. Have a great week, Lions.